no one gets everything he wants. We wanted a mission, and for our fandom, they gave us one. Forced it on us with the High Republic, Ahsoka, and the Acolyte. It wasn't a real choice mission, and if it ends, we'll never want another one. Have we lived long enough to be called villains by villains? Are we winning or losing, or simply fading like ghosts into the fog? George is gone. Lucasfilm is the worst place in the world, and everyone knows it now. A decade removed and dozens of failures later, on a streaming service that snakes through the culture war like a main circuit cable, plugged straight into Kathleen Kennedy. It was no accident that we got to be the caretaker of Star Wars memory, any more than being back on YouTube was an accident. There is no way to tell its story without telling our own, and if its story is a testimony, then so is ours. The tyrants who fund Disney's puppet regime demand regular sacrifices on the altar of their three-letter imperatives. So collaborators led their cash cows to the slaughter. Star Wars, Disney, Disney Animation, Animation Marvel, Pixar, Pixar, Willow, Willow Peter, Pan, Peter Pan, Indiana, Indiana Jones, 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 and on and, and on and on. But idols soaked in blood don't demoralize true fans. We've been called toxic and misogynist for criticizing a decade of intersectional relativism in a skin mask sliced from the carcass of Star Wars. During the Kennedy Epoch, with rare exceptions from individuals who revere George's work, the production subverts Star Wars, supplant its lore with elitist socio-political doctrine, repurpose the IP as a platform for the message. The latest degradation of Star Wars, the Acolyte, is a tale about institutional corruption created through institutional corruption. A parasite is a paradox as it feeds and thereby causes harm, but ultimately relies on its host for survival. Lucasfilm's leaders use Star Wars to spread the message, but the message destroys Star Wars. We've stared into the heart of darkness and found it projects its evils back on us. If this war ends, we will rest. But until then, we will have more of Kennedy's D minus series. Thank you.